What's up guys, Dick Bin in here, and we're playing Just Cause 3, and this is the DLC for the Sky Fortress, and uh, we're supposed to be able to unlock a jetpack, but um, I have the Season Pass, which you unlock this really cool red wingsuit and parachute, but sadly, it goes away when you get the jetpack, and that's kind of lame, but nonetheless, let's start this mission. I kind of want to give you guys the first kind of like 10 minute look the first mission and you getting the jetpack and flying around and checking out the sky fortress so bear with me let's check this area out and i'm excited man i've been waiting for this dlc for a while i'm glad they finally got a jetpack and what is going on with the cows are you guys hungry for some beef today maybe we can make some meatloaf some bacon burgers some <laughs> some yummy 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 steak patties even my daughter's like yummy yummy <laughs> so let's start this mission and see what's up Sheldon, what happened here? What's going on? There you are. I'm afraid we're facing a new threat, hombre. I was just outside this village. Then something appeared out of nowhere and started shooting at everyone and everything. It was a massacre, plain and simple. Now in the chaos, I think one of the rebels managed to take the flying robot down. More Medicians dead. What are these robots? Not sure. They seem to be weaponized drones of some sort. Eden. Yeah, they were this big corporation back in the day. They, they were doing all kinds of super advanced scientific research. Uh, robotics, aeronautics, nano stuff. Let me guess. Another one of your clients, Sheldon. Where can I find them? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, son. I just recognized the logo from way back. I thought they went bust decades ago. Well, apparently not. And now I need to stop them. I got a nice present for oh, you. Oh, yeah. A little something to help you navigate the friendly skies. Should have gave me that a while ago. Made in Medici. Courtesy that looks of cool. Dima Al Masri. Perfect timing. Hey, watch out, partner. I got a really bad feeling about these drones. We need to know what we're up against. Try not to blow it up. Don't worry, Sheldon. I live for stealth. So, um, I don't know how I feel about it being just kind of like picture cutscenes there. Like, normally it has actual, you know, people moving around, so I think it may be just a little cheap, but... Nonetheless, if you guys want to know, the Sky Fortress DLC will be released March 15th, if you don't have the Season Pass. It costs $11.99, and if you guys want to go ahead and buy the Season Pass, it costs $24.99, and you can already play. It comes out a week early if you have the Season Pass, so I recommend getting the Season Pass. It costs double the price of the DLC, but you get other DLCs later in the future, so I think it's definitely worth it. This feels really good, like, I was really scared that the jetpack would be really, really limited. And it's not even upgraded yet, because you can't upgrade it. So, starting off, it works pretty damn good. I also heard that you're supposed to get weapons on it, so hopefully the weapons come soon, and they work well. I'm pretty sure, though, like, the upgrade just be like, you can... You can boost faster, you can boost more about your boost going down, you can shoot your weapons more before they overheat, type stuff like that. I'm not excited to jump back into more, like, wingsuit missions. Like, some of them are fun, but... Uh, they're time-consuming, and they get very frustrating. Alright, we're back. I had a little mishap there where I just busted my butt like ten times. Be careful with the wingsuit and trees. They don't go together. <laughs> but we're here, my favorite rocket launcher. I call it the Devastator, because it destroys everything it's near. But it can kill you real easily, so it's kind of like gotta be far away. It's not one of those just blow up everything near you rocket launchers. <laughs> Makes me feel like I'm playing a uh, Earth Defense Force. <laughs> it's a little fun game when we'll beat in PS4. So these are the droids. Like, these guys can be very annoying. Like, they can really gain up on you, but they're kind of fun to, more than anything, kind of pull down and, like, wreck with your, like, your harness grappling hook rather than shoot at. But maybe we'll get, like, some new weapons here in this DLC, too, so... It'd be really cool. We're going to show it all off, so be sure to keep it locked on Duck Opinion, where dust can fly. So, like and subscribe. I'm surprised that... Got him. 
It's a fire wing wing so fire wing suit mechanic gun. So I guess I have the weapons now. It's good. Ooh, I love it. I feel like Iron Man. I feel like, like Rocket Man. You guys ever watched that old movie? I think it was like maybe 80s, 90s movie called Rocket Man. It was cool. I like this though. It really feels like like oh, it feels good. It does. It doesn't feel limited really. And I can't wait to really like max it out. Like once I beat this DLC, max it out. I want to see like how good it can fly and how limited it is and how limited it's not. We'll definitely show all that off. We've got lots of videos coming for this DLC. So keep a lookout. All right, all right. The rockets. Oh, whoa. The rockets are working okay. There, there's a big uh, time on though. You can't just you can only shoot one at a time. I don't like that. Maybe it'll get better here. I got something to explode. Oh, I love that gun. Electric hellstorm. It's like letting off a mini nuke and fall out. Shoot it! Shoot it! Shoot it! Ugh. I'm trying to get used to the guns on here. They don't. You can't like shoot them right away. So obviously it needs some upgrades. Oh, uh, it's gonna kill me. Yep. That killed me. Sorry. Yeah, you gotta be careful with this gun. It's like I said before. This gun will change your life. But you know it's up to you. This is just my preference. I like using this gun like a heavy gun. But you guys can use what you want. I mean, I beat the game before I played this DLC. I imagine it's a little bit harder if you kind of just got the game and you tried to play this DLC. But at least you can unlock the jetpack right away, I'm pretty sure. So that'd be kind of cool. But I've already beaten the game and I've unlocked every single area on the game. So a lot of hours I put into it. <laughs> Great game. I think it's fully worth it. Definitely need a better gun though. This gun isn't quite working for me. It's like 9 out of 10, I don't even know where I'm being shot from. Like, I see the people, but... <laughs> They're main. Man, I like how he explodes, but still... You're not taking me out, fool! It's like I shoot so much, and they shoot me like twice, and I'm almost dead. <laughs> Alright, there, good. Your actions are of no impact to our organization. Listen, I got a guy working at the Air Traffic Control Center here, and guess what? They picked up some kind of anomaly somewhere above Medici. Something obstructing the airspace, they said. I told them to send you the coordinates. That's got to be Drone Central Station. So, I looked you up. The famous Rico Rodriguez, dictator specialist. All right, Ethan Gallahan. Who are you? What do you people want? Oh, so you were listening. For a minute there, I thought all these explosions and gunshots had damaged your hearing permanently. I'm coming for you, Ethan. And I will stop you. You actually don't understand what you're dealing with, do you? It's not too late to surrender. Heading up now, Sheldon. But I don't get it. Why would the Eden Corporation want so much Bavarium? Beats me. But apparently they're not afraid to kill civilians to get it. That's where so yeah, there's a good bit of story in this game. If you guys so, feel it, you know, we can continue showing off the story like we've been doing. Just let me know what you guys think and uh, subscribe, like, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Sheldon, we have a little problem. They've got an airship. What? An airship? God damn it! How the hell did those guys pull that off? Looks like a massive tanker. I bet Bavarium is powering the whole ship. Well, that explains why they're so hell-bent on extracting it. And they'll want more of it at any cost. And I doubt they'll ask politely. 
I won't let them cause any more harm to the people of Medici. They've suffered enough. Yeah. You know... Gentlemen, allow me to intervene. If you've come to negotiate your surrender, I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. However, if you keep destroying company property, I'm afraid it will have some very unfortunate consequences. This is your last warning. All right. Then let's do some negotiation. Hey guys, Duck here. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you guys could support the channel by liking and subscribing and even leaving a comment below, it'd really mean a lot to me. And if you guys want to go the extra mile, we have a Patreon page. You can check it out in the link in the description below. And we have different goals that you guys can donate to and it would really help keep this channel afloat. Thank you guys so much for listening. Ducks can fly, so please help us survive. Peace.